open the image containing the spider cube in your raw conversion software. In this example, we'll show how to adjust the raw image using Adobe Lightroom. Use the white balance tool, sometimes called the gray balance tool, which is typically an eyedropper to set the color temperature. This will also set the tint if your software includes tint adjustment. Set by clicking on the gray section of one of the split faces. Choose the brighter face as it represents your primary light source. Adjust exposure so that none of the color channels are clipped in your raw converter's histogram. Keep an eye on the cube in the image for reference as you make this adjustment. Next, brightness can be adjusted to compensate for any lightening or darkening that occurred during the exposure adjustment. Check the RGB values of the gray face under the primary light source. This face is 18% gray and can be used to determine how light or dark image midtones should be. Finally, set your black levels using the black level eyedropper if your software offers one and clicking on the black trap. If your software does not have a black level dropper, set the black slider to show a clear distinction between the black in the black trap and that of the surrounding black face.